99.9 FM, the East Bay's best Friday. I got BZD Beast Man. in the building. Huh? What's poppin' with it, man? Man, you know, just dropped the mixtape, trying to promote like this, came through the the next level, man. You know yeah. I had to. Yes, so the mixtape, let's get to the project right now. What is the name of it, and who's on it, produced it, or whatnot? Um, I call it, it's called My Beautiful Nightmare, man. It's like, a, I'm giving them my life, you know what I mean? My yeah. life like a beautiful nightmare, you know what I mean? Yeah. You gotta take the good with the bad, the ups and the down, you know what I mean? You know how I, I you know, nightmare can start off good and end up bad and vice versa, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So, yeah and I got uh I got a couple producers on there. I got uh you know I got reset beats, he yeah. uh he got actually out of like uh, overseas Europe. You know wow! I mean? yeah. How'd you get connected with over there? Um, I did Team Backpack, I won Team Backpack uh -huh. the competition they do, uh the Cyber Series uh, right. 2012 competition. Congratulations! Yeah man, first uh, we came finalist first four finalists out of five hundred people, you know. So. And, lot, and when did this go down? Uh, last, what was that, June, I believe? Wow. Last June, yeah. Amazing. Uh, How, what did you learn from being in a uh, competition contest like that? Man, I learned a lot about myself, honestly. You know what I mean? Like, what you know, you top three things. Uh, one was, don't ever doubt yourself. You know what I mean? Yeah. Two, be yourself. <laughs> you know what I mean? And three, just, you know what I mean? Like, like I said, you gotta, like, man, it's like that. Believe in yourself. <laughs> I got out there and I, I met so many like cats that rap, you know what I mean? And yeah. they like, it's people outside, nervous, sweating, like, oh man, I'm trying to remember this verse I just did. Yeah. Like, I didn't write nothing from the audition to the, you know what I mean, the Free -time. competition. I didn't write nothing wow. for it. So it's like, like I say, if you believe in it, you can achieve it. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. So it, you know what I mean? Not, it's never, yeah. But I did that, so that's how I met dude from uh, Europe, you know what I mean? Shout out to Reset. He sent me a couple beats. I got him yeah. on there. I got, uh, Another cat named Action, he up and coming out the bay, you know what I mean? That's one of my boys. I got him producing a few things. Uh, my DJ, DJ Rebellion, shout out to Rebellion. I, uh, he he did a couple of them for me. He produced a yeah. couple beats on there for me. So, you know, I got a, and, and Dre Day, shout out to Dre Day too. I can't forget about you, but man, that's crazy. That's my DJ right there. Bro. <laughs> Live on the air. Dre, huh? uh, you, so, you meant more like confidence is yeah, what, what that, building yeah. up that. And, in, in a comp it was more like a competition. Yeah, it's a competition. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Not oh. cockiness, but confidence. You know? Yeah, you gotta yeah. Believe Most it, definitely. Yeah. yeah, yeah. To sell the product. Exactly. Most definitely. So, so congratulations on that win as Thank well. You. Now, where do you want to? Where do you see yourself next? What is the next move? Oh man, I, like I said, I just dropped this uh, this mixtape, so I'm working on this. I just I got a show next month in Texas, actually. Wow. Too. Yeah, we hooked up with some cats out there, man. And uh, you know it's. Just, Going from there, you know what I mean? From the mixtape, just going from there. So it's, yeah. man, it's a blessing right now. Everything's starting to fall into place. Man. That's amazing. So, so you're talking about like you you did sh you did you doing a show in Texas? Have you done shows anywhere else? Oh uh, yeah, we are up and down California from Chico to Santa Barbara. We done done them all. Man. Santa, Santa now Asian Santa. man's calling me, man. Uh, Come on, everybody's <laughs> calling me right now. Red. Come on, yeah, we'll call you back uh, after these messages. Anyways, go ahead, continue. Yeah, so we've done it from all up in California, all up and down California, man, from Chico to to, to Santa Barbara. Yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? So all up and down California, we've been doing everything. Right? Amazing. So so uh what did you learn? Give me your top two shows. Well the, each of the which one did you when what did you learn from those top two shows? Um top two, let me see. Number two would have to be one of the first times I ever performed, it was at one of the, uh, you ever heard of Super Hyphy? Mm -hmm. That they do in Petaluma and Santa yep. Rosa, we performed at, what, uh -huh. like 18 or something like that? I think wow. it was like 18, we performed at Super Hyphy. And that was crazy, because like, we was like the last of the openers. You really? know what I mean? Before like, wow. the, the, the big name started. Right. So when we got on stage, like, we cracking, they trying to break the barricade, security <laughs> holes, and like everything. So that was cracking, I'll never forget that. And that was one of my first times performing. And then, uh, and that was probably like what, oh five, oh six, huh? Oh, Couple man. years ago. Yeah. Okay. And then, uh, my number one favorite show of all time got to be this one we did in Santa Barbara one time. Man. Like my old camp, everybody I know, Rich Watson, Circus, TK, Taz, uh, Young Doe performed. Uh, we had Cheddar Mackin and them up there, man. Everybody performed, but like our show CD that day, cause we was grinding. This must have been. This was probably like 07, 08. Yeah. And like I remember being at the house making that show CD, and that show CD was 45 minutes. Damn. And we never lost that set. Like, we never lost the crowd. You know what I mean? I never wow. forget that show. 45, 45 minutes. Set, minutes. And we never lost the crowd. You know what I mean? That we had, they, we was cracking. That was one of my favorites. I never forget that one. That's what's up, man. So okay, so uh, you named a couple people that you working on the album and whatnot, but. If you could work with anybody internationally, worldwide, any genre, and it was top three people, who would you want to work with? Mm, that's crazy. Right now, uh, let me see. 
anybody anywhere. Off right top. Now. Worldwide. If I can do a song with, let me see. A lot, let me go, too. Singer, yeah. Let me go. Singer right now, if I can do a song with Singer, I have to do Mary J. You know, Mary J been doing it for so long. Like, she got so much respect in the game. I have to Make go on Yeah. I have to do something with Jay. You know what mm. I mean? You got to mess with Jay-Z. Mm. Yeah, I have to. Oh! And then, who else? Let me see. I, I hop on something, man. I, I would hop on something with Wayne, bro. Mm -hmm. Mixtape Wayne. I need the real one. <laughs> I need mixtape Wayne on Wayne. But yeah, yeah, I hop on something with That's what's up, most definitely. So check that out as well. So hop into everybody that's tuning in right now, listening to you for the first time on the radio. What do you want them to know about you? Man, I'm nothing like everything you hear out the bay, man. We're breath of fresh air. That's a quote, too. You know what I mean? They say we a breath of fresh air, it's different music, like you know, real music for everyday life. You know what I mean? For like, I make music, timeless music instead of music for the times. Mm -hmm. So, like, quote me on that. And, yeah, and, and hold me to that. <laughs> so, yeah. so you, you, what, did, what makes you different from the other artists? Saying that I feel like. Like I said, we make more relatable everyday music to like where you can, I want to make music where you can pop my CD in 10, 20 years down the road and it's still going to slap, you know what I mean? Like it's relevant, exactly, like because I'm not going, I don't, I try not to make music that is going to go out when these fans go out, like yeah. all right, when 2013 and everything that came hot in 2013 is gone, that music gone too, nah, nah. you know what I mean? I want mine around forever, exactly, 2050. Uh, 3000, you know I mean? uh, most definitely. Real. So, so uh, much, much success your way. So let's go into uh, your contacts: Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, email. You said you got a All website. Right. Yeah, we got a website. It's sbtnt.com. That's sbtnt.com. And we got me and everybody on my camp over there. Who's part of the camp? Uh, we got Taz, uh, my boy Young Doe, and Circus TK, man. Y'all check them out. We all go crazy. You know what I mean? Y'all yeah. can bet on bees for that. I guarantee it. On the website. Uh -huh. So, uh, then I got my Twitter. It's uh, at HighLifeBeezy, H-I-G-H-L-I-F-E-B-E-A-Z-Y. And uh, Instagram is the same. Um, and then I got my Facebook. It's backslash Bees85, B-E-A-Z-85. You know, I try to stay up with the social media. You know, yeah. Gotta stay in their face. Yeah, most definitely. So, uh, let's get shout outs. You want to shout anybody out? Man, shout out to my whole team, man. Everybody that know me, shout out to everybody, man. Everybody trying to do it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Stay at it. Let's, just, let's go get it. There's money in these streets, man. We can go get it. We unify. Shout out to the bank. Yeah. Like that. Most definitely. Most definitely. So, anything else you want people to know before we hit commercial? Oh, man. Just like I said, look for me. Wait for me. I'm coming, man. Bet on B's. We up next. High Life Records. You know what I mean? SBTNT, Freeway Legends, we up next. Wait for us, we coming.